to be doing this show at the world-famous television city. A lot of television uh, is being filmed here. In fact, we share this building with The Young and the Restless. Does anyone know that, right? But what I didn't know until the other day is that we also share a printer. OK, oh. our office and their office share a printer. Completely true. In fact, this morning, our writer's assistant, Sergio, who's just there. Hello, Sergio. <laughs> <laughs> Sergio's there, totally not expecting to be on television. <laughs> um, so he, uh, he, he handed me uh, this this morning, which is an actual scene from The Young and the Restless that was left in our copier. And I thought it might be fun, given that we've got Chris Pine and Patricia Arquette, two mega stars of the big screen, to perform this scene that they've never read before. Does this sound fun? Yeah. You want more? Yeah. You sound fun? Yeah. OK, so... So, I will, I will, so they've never seen these scripts before, okay? So, don't look too much now. I will give there. This is your script there. Uh, Patricia, this is yours here. So, here are your costumes, right. okay? Yeah. There are your scripts. So, for one night only, Chris Pine, Academy Award winner Patricia Arquette and myself will be the stars of The Young and the Restless. Okay, let's go. All right. James Corden as Jack. Chris Pine as Austin. Patricia Arquette as Phyllis. Uh, I'm having this marriage annulled immediately. I committed a crime, Phyllis. People were hurt because of it. Damn it! <laughs> but I'll own up to that. I've been working hard, baby. I've been working hard, turning things around ever since. Thanks to Summer. <laughs> oh, you're... <laughs> you're claiming you're a better man now? Oh! How is that possible when you've done nothing but lied to me since I first met you? For all I know, you're armed and dangerous right now. You know that's not true. <laughs> Damn it, we all need to... <laughs> we all need to calm down. Yeah. Jack, why didn't you tell me our daughter's married to a criminal? Our daughter and I were both looking out for your health. My health? What is making me sick is hearing that same old excuse. Somehow, I'm managing to stand, talk, and breathe, and even after reading that my felon son-in-law pulled a gun on my sister and kidnapped her. Avery forgave Austin. Look at these pictures, Phyllis. <laughs> See how happy they were at the <laughs> wedding. She looks just like you. Is that a photo of Paul Williams throwing rice on the happy couple? No, probably not. Since the groom shot the chief of police in cold blood. Wait, damn it! No! Calm down, Austin Phyllis, jeez! isn't the only one here who was charged with almost killing Paul Williams. It was somebody else in this room. <laughs> My coma! I think I'm having a coma. <laughs> I'm having a coma, did you just say? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, 